The Maryland Nano Center. In the race to make more efficient batteries, scientists would like to back together a tiny nano wire, a strip of metal of a thousand of times smaller than a human hair. My name is Mia Le Tai. I'm a researcher with University of California, Irvine, and a member of Nanostructure of Electrical Energy Storage Team. We are part of the Department of Energy effort to push the frontiers of research. Other team has tried to make battery using nanotube made of carbon, but our team combined gold coin and manganese dioxide cell to make its nano wires because it can hold more charge than carbon could. We use the nano wire as the electrode, the charge making part of the battery. However, the manganese dioxide tends to separate from the gold nano wire when electricity passes through them repeatedly. We recently replaced the electrolyte, the child carrier part of the battery, with a gel similar to plexiglass called PMA. We carried our nanowires with the gel and feather. We can pass electricity through these nanowires hundreds of thousands of times. Within three months, we charge and extract these nanowire battery constantly and watch it for the sign of splitting or degradation. Here you can see the difference between thousands of cycles using PMMJ electrolyte and the sample that was bare. The coated nanowire hole is shaped much better, making it more reliable option for a nanowire based battery. This has helped prove that nanowire based battery electro can have a long lifetime and that in turn someday will have make nanowire based battery a reality.